Welcome back. Hope you've all had a good season. Um, we've just obviously come to end of ours now, and so we're going to start these video sessions again. Uh, this one we're just going to go through about how we fill the AV. Uh, and pretty much there's two ways of filling the AV. There's the sort of slightly easier way and slightly more difficult way, depending on what system you've got set up. So the slightly easier way is if you can get a boiler, they hold about nine liters of water, and you really want them to fill up to about 70 degrees uh, before you actually fill these AVs. So that's the, the, about the right temperature, about 70 degrees. Um, and all you need is these hose locks. Uh, it's fairly straightforward, you put a hose lock on the end, you clip that on. You get these adapters um, that we just actually just screw on to the top of the AV like this. Connect the other end on and away you go. The about this method, it's fairly easy, fairly straightforward and fills up the AV quickly. The downside is you, 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 not, you don't know how much you're actually putting in there. So the best way is actually to fill the AVs up as full as you can and then just before you go do the collection. So the other way to fill the AVs up um, is again through a, using a jug and a funnel into the AV. Uh, this is usually if you, if you haven't got a boiler, you can use a boiling kettle. And the way that you do this is fill this up to about three quarters boiling and about a quarter of that cold. And the best way to work out the temperature is get one of these temperature gauges um, and we'll show you how this works. Now. Again, we want this set at about 70 degrees, that's the sort of water that temperature that we want the water to go in at, uh, around about 70 degrees. So this is a quite a good indicator. There's two ways you can pour the water into these AVs. You can sometimes you can use a, one of these drenching syringes, they just fall in and you can actually fill it up that way. Or most probably a little bit easier is just get a, a funnel, chop the end off the funnel, try and get the fit as, as snug as you can. Wind it onto the end, lift it up and then just pour it in. Um, so sort of the downside to this way is that it obviously takes a lot longer to fill. The upside to it is you can work out exactly how much water you're putting in to the AV. And you might know your stallion might need exactly two litres or three litres or two and a half litres. Um, so you can actually make this a measured amount. Whereas the other way, you have to uh, just fill it up as full as you can and then let it out just before the collection takes place. So you just hold the AV at a slight angle, so the water goes in and the air can come back out again. And once you're happy you've filled it up, you should take that off. And there you have it, and you can go off to your collection. Okay, next time we're going to talk about how we wash the AVs up and do all our cleaning as well. Thank you.